Well, here we are again, back in this corner. What's up guys, my name is Nicole and welcome to Nicole Topics and today's topic is figure skating dresses. In case some of you guys do not know, I, besides from YouTube, I also do figure skating. And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys all the figure skating dresses I've worn and owed and that I worn for Tess's competitions and shows. Yes, we do test and yeah. It will be like a little trip to nostalgia lane. I guess this will be no different from like another YouTuber's like spring outfit haul or summer outfit haul or back to school haul. So just think of this as like a haul, figure skating edition. So let's let's go to this journey. Here, here's my hand. Come with me. So this is the very first dress I owned, and I guess you could say this is more of a dance outfit than a traditional figure skating dress, but this is, outfit is actually really um precious to me because this is like the outfit I worn for the very first time that I actually like performed on ice, so yeah. I have everyone's faces blurred out in this long shot because I'm not sure if I'm allowed to have their faces out in this video even though this picture is posted publicly on my Rink's Facebook page so who knows, I'm just doing this to be safe. Considering YouTube has some strict rules especially for minors on camera a fun fact about this dress is that I was in 6th grade at the time, so yeah, you could imagine how much I've changed since then because, I mean, look at my bangs. Look at it. <laughs> it's crazy. And this upcoming footage you'll see is me performing in that dress. And if you want to see the full version of it, please check out N Skates. It's my other channel that I post my skating videos in, so yeah. Here's the footage. I never performed in this, but I'll still count this in the video anyways. This is the very first traditional skating dress I guess you could say I owned. Um, it's a red, plain, I believe it's like a $60 one, I think. It's actually a really comfortable dress. The reason why I never performed in this dress is because this was used for my 12 year old birthday party because the theme of that birthday party that year was ice skating because that's basically around the time I started so I was, you could imagine like I was basically still in the honeymoon phase so I was really 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 obsessed with it like I'm still obsessed with it now but I was extremely obsessed with it back then so yeah I got that for to wear to my ice skating birthday party I still wish I kind of owned this dress but anyways this is my very first competition dress so i was still 12 at the time and i wore this for my very first competition sadly i could not find any footage of me skating to this but the song i skated to was victory by bond so if you guys want to like search that up after the video then go ahead but uh yeah this was a really nice dress i i really love like the sparkle and it just really made me feel special while i was performing it so a few months go by and I'm now in 7th grade, I'm 13 year old, and this is shot is my second year in the winter show and the very last year I performed in a group. And basically I, we, I was, I really love this outfit. I loved how sassy the song and the dress had to it, especially the leg warmers, like I really love the leg warmers, those were the best. And lucky for you guys, I do have some footage to show you guys of me and my group skating to this. And if you want to see the full version of it, check out N Skates because that's that's where it is. <laughs> Time 
skip again a few months later and I am now like perform need to perform in my second competition. So this is what I wore for my second competition. The program used for this mainly was On the Floor Instrumental by JLo and this is by far the ver my favorite program I've ever skated to. I really had a blast with this and so much good memories from it. So this dress was used for the very same music, JLo on the floor, but I used this for my winter show, my third year to winter show actually. I was in 8th grade and yeah, I really liked this dress, it was actually pretty nice. The only con I had about is that, you know, like, it's not like one of those dresses you can just like plop on and like button on in the back, it's actually one of those dresses where you actually have to button down like the leotard area and the bottom and that's pretty hard to do so yeah now this dress is tied with a crazy story so i basically got this dress the day of when i had to do a skating test and the reason i had to get a day of is because usually when i test i wear a leotard and a black um matching skirt with it but i forgot the skirt at home that day so i had no choice but to buy a new dress and luckily it fit because it's an extra small and I'm actually a medium. <laughs> so yeah, luck was with me on that side of the, that day and yeah, it's a very crazy story. If you guys are curious of hearing that, then if this video gets like 5 likes, then I'll make a story time video on that story. But uh, yeah, this was my very first time using a Chloe Noel dress and... Yeah, here's some footage of me doing this test with the dress on, and again, as I've said like two times already, if you want to see the full version of that, check out N Skates. So this is the most latest dress I own. This was for used to for my latest program I just done, The Promise. And I really like how fancy and sparkly this dress is. It really makes me feel like a real competitor, if you know what I mean. So and that's the video guys. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Cheerio!